Hello everyone, my name is Nushin Nabavi and I am presenting on behalf of a research team put together by Muhammad Ali Tahiri on the effects of Tahiri consciousness field on survival and behavior of cancer cell lines. In this presentation, we will introduce the consciousness theory as proposed by Tahiri and provide experimental evidence of consciousness fields as observed outside of the body in living cells and in living organisms. The Tahiri consciousness field is uh, a novel approach presented by Muhammad Ali Tahiri. Um, in this theory, consciousness is introduced as one of the three elements of the universe, so which is neither matter nor energy, but it has direct effects on both matter and energy uh, through specific and distinct non-material, non-energetic fields called consciousness fields. Uh, consciousness fields can exert their function on humans, animals, plants, microorganisms, and materials alike. Consciousness fields are subcategories of a richly networked universal internet called Cosmic Consciousness Network, or CCN. Uh, we can connect to CCN through a virtual connection called ETESAL. A consciousness field is formed and is followed by scanning and correction of treated samples. So we cannot prove the existence of consciousness field and CCN, but we can assess and verify its effects on matter and energy through reproducible scientific experiments. The consciousness theory is part of a new science uh, called the science fact as proposed by Muhammad Ali Tahiri. And, uh, the science fact is different from conventional science, which is, uh, which is concerned with the world of matter and energy. Science fact is uh, concerned with cosmic internet and consciousness fields. So you might ask, how do we apply the Tahiri consciousness field? Uh, to do this, a request is sent to connect to the cosmic consciousness field and utilize the consciousness fields through the Cosmo Intel website in the Assign uh, Announcement section. Uh, this access is free and available to anyone at no cost. Uh, to study and experience this connection, a researcher can register on the website at any time and report their intention to experiment on the Cosmo Intel Research Center. Uh, specific details of the experiment must be provided, for example, the characteristics or the number or name of the samples and the controls should be provided. And the entire experiment is carried out as a double-blind method where lab technicians are completely unaware of the consciousness fields being applied and the Cosmetal um, Research Center who establishes the connection are unaware of the details of this study. For the rest of this presentation, I will present uh, three investigations that use uh, the consciousness field um, and assess its effects on uh, living systems. Uh, previously, using an MTT assay, uh, the research team has shown that the cell cycle analysis and expression of genes related to cell death or apoptosis was affected through the consciousness field number one in MCF7 uh, breast cancer cell lines. Um, so the consciousness field affected cell proliferation and survival in uh, 2D cell cultures. Um, in order to investigate the reproducibility of these results, um, various other cell lines, uh, including SW480, HT29, JERCAT and LAN5 cells were used. Um, the experiment specifically uh, tested cell viability and cell death uh, under Faradamani consciousness uh, uh, under 12 and 48 hours of influence. And um, also cell death was assessed using the expression of BCL2 and Bax gene uh, monitoring.
So MTT assay was used to assess the mitosis and apoptotic rates of cell lines. And as shown in the top right figure, uh, the consciousness field to decreased survival and increased apoptosis of the SW480 cell line. And uh, in the case of HT29, the consciousness field increased survival. Um, so in both cases, the, the, both the TCF1 and TCF2 increased apoptosis rates. And in the bottom figure, the tracking of the cell cycle progression using flow cytometry shows the proliferative effects of the consciousness field 1 on HT29 cells and the apoptotic effects of the uh, consciousness field 2 on SW480 cells as well as the HT29. Uh, this analysis indicates the possibility of cell cycle arrest at the G2 phase uh, by, as affected by the consciousness field 1 and at the S phase by the consciousness field 2 uh, in JERCAT and LAN5 cells respectively. In a complementary second experiment, the role of consciousness field 1 was assessed on human mesenchymal stem cells that were isolated from bone marrow. And um, the effect of the consciousness field 1 after 24 hours was assessed in these cells through uh, investigating their proliferative rates, uh, telomerase lengths, as well as telomerase activity. The results from this experiment shows that the consciousness field 1 increases the proliferation rate of MSCs by 20%. Uh, and as shown in Table 1, um, the telomerase length, length and activity was increased at 12 and 11% compared to non-treated controls with a significant p-value of less than 0.05. In another experiment, uh, the influence of the consciousness field was assessed on 41 cell lines in a 3D microfluidic uh, microenvironment, as well as a 41 orthopic breast cancer spontaneous metastasis in uh, bulb C mouse models. So for the case of the 41 breast cancer model, the effect of the consciousness field was investigated in two ways either uh, a treatment of the consciousness field prior to injection of the tumor in mice or at the same time as the tumor was growing in the mice models. The results from the in vivo model show that the size of the tumor was significantly smaller in the pre-treated tumors and those implanted in the mice uh, compared to non-treated controls. So comparing figures B and C to D, which is the untreated control. Um, you can compare the average size, volume, and weight of the tumors in the, th the three different groups. And so uh, we can conclude that the consciousness field 2 has an apoptotic effect and reduces the survival of cancerous cells in vivo conditions. In conclusion, the consciousness field 1 shows a positive effect on cell survival outside of living organisms, and the consciousness field 2 has an apoptotic effect and reduces survival of cancer cells in vitro conditions. Uh, similarly, in vivo investigations showed that the consciousness field 1 inhibited the growth, metastasis, and proliferation of cancer cells. These studies shed more light on the potential benefits of the consciousness field in prevention and treatment of cancers, but we suggest that these experiments are repeated and um, the effects of the consciousness fields are investigated on various cancers by other research groups. This concludes our presentation on investigating the effects of 
Tahari Consciousness Field on Survival and Behavior of Cancer Cells. For more information, please visit the Cosmo Intel website. And um, the consciousness field researchers are invited to collaborate uh, on reproducing and potentially extending uh, these studies on consciousness fields. Thank you for listening and please send us any questions.